Hi guys, and welcome to a new Mimi blog thingy. Today we'll be continuing comparing Volume 2 of the manga to the anime with Chapter 8. Where we last left off in the manga, the girls head to a TV station to stop Keisha's planned attack on Zakuro. The anime equivalent to this chapter is the second half of Episode 11. In the anime, Ichigo goes to the TV station alone since Keisha has trapped the other three girls in another dimension, and will only release them if she and Zakuro fight each other and the winner has to join him. Because of this, the events leading up to the fight scene are different. In the anime, we see the girls in the other dimension, who talk about how creepy the place is and something about it is suppressing their powers. We then cut to the TV station where Ichigo is having trouble explaining herself to a staff member. Zakuro tells her that it's okay and Ichigo asks for Zakuro's help in saving the other girls. Zakuro then mentions that she knows who Ryo and Keiichiro are and says that she refuses to work with selfish people, strongly implying that she refused to join since they infused her without her permission. Ichigo begs for her help, and Zakuro starts to consider it when she realizes that Ichigo has no intention of fighting her. Before Zakuro can give an answer, the TV show she's guest starring in is about to begin and she gets called on set. In the manga, the girls also have trouble getting into the studio, but it's by a security officer. When asked why they should go in, Booling hilariously proclaims that they're heroes. When that doesn't work, she then uses some incense to knock him out. They then dress up in rabbit outfits, except for Booling who dresses up as a cute little panda, one of the staff members mistakes them for mascots used for the TV show and they go on set. In both the anime and manga, the Annie Annie Animal Show starts and then it gets attacked. In the anime, Kish used the spirit of the staff lady to make a Cobra Chimera, while in the manga, all of the animals in the studio change. Ichigo then transforms and saves Zakuro from a Chimera, although in the manga it was a cheetah. In the manga, Kish removes the parasite aliens from the existing Chimera and combines them into a snake-like monster called a Parasite Anima, which is probably where the idea of the Cobra Chimera from the anime came from. Due to the change of circumstance in the anime, the sequences in this scene are different. In the anime, the Chimera grabs Ichigo after her attempt to save Zakuro. She then tells Zakuro that she considers her a friend. The Chimera then attacks them both. Ichigo, injured from the attack, finds that Zakuro is left, and Kish then tries to convince her to join him. She refuses and attempts to attack, but her injuries are too severe. We then cut to the other girls who are about to be swallowed by the Shrieking Dimension. The power of Zakuro's transformation breaks through the dimension, and she uses her attack to break them out. Back to the fight, the Chimera attempts to finish Ichigo off, despite Kish's orders not to, but Zakuro's attack fends it off in time. The other girls then attempt to fight it off, but their attacks have no effect. In the manga, since the girls were never captured, they attack the parasite anima right when it appears. Like with the anime, it has no effect. Then it attacks the girls and grabs Ichigo. Kish then flirts with her in a threatening way, but gets interrupted by Zakuro transforming and using her attack to free Ichigo. In both the anime and manga, the Mimi's power suddenly merge with Ichigo, but there's a huge difference in its result. In the anime, the powers combine into streams of light that grab onto the Cobra Chimera, and then Ichigo finishes it off with her usual ribbon strawberry check attack. In the manga, the combined powers upgrades Ichigo's weapon into the Straw Bell Bell version up, which is never shown in the anime. Ichigo then defeats the Parasite Anima with Rib and Strawberry Chick Surprise. After the fight is over, Ryo, who sees what happens on TV, is impressed on how much Ichigo's powers have evolved. What happens after this are the same in both the anime and manga, except the scenes are swapped. In the anime, Kish leaves the fight and Zakuro decides to join the team. The girls have a group hug but are interrupted by the TV show host and Ichigo realizes that they were on live TV. She gets bombarded with questions and she introduces herself and the others as Tokyo Mew Mew for the first time. Aoyama also happens to see the broadcast and the episode ends with Ryo calling Ichigo an idiot. In the manga, the TV incident is exactly the same, but the part where Zakuro announces that she'll join the team happens afterwards, after she helps sneak the girls out of the studio and they've changed back. The chapter ends with the girls happy that they're finally all together. And with that, we end this chapter comparison and this vlog thingy. If there are any other Mimi topics you want me to talk about, put them in the comments below. Tune in next time where we'll finish off Volume 2 of the manga with Chapter 9.